То, что было в планах. Это здание перед нами, это пятый энергоблок, только пятый. Шестой на момент катастрофы находился в стадии фундамента, сейчас затопленного фундамента. Э -э, ржавые такие вот куски металла, те, которыми покрыто здание, это не не покрашенные стены конструкции. Ни в коем случае это те места, где был попросту скелет, где был попросту фундамент и не было стен. Э -э, так как само здание было готово процентов на 55, ну 60 в лучшем случае, это образно, грубо говоря. Но не так медленно. Так медленно. Эти куски металла это что-то наподобие материала, которым здание консервировали. Так как самые серьезные инженеры Советского Союза, они очень сильно недооценили катастрофу. Люди всерьез полагали, что реактор номер 4 вернется в работу в конце лета, максимум осени 86 -го года. Собственно, как мы видим перед нами чуть дальше налево, они были почти правы. Поэтому третью очередь строительства было решено заморозить, а не, а не остановить. Тем не менее... No point to it. Okay. Kept it off then. Слово я не знаю. Вот только время нам покажет. Это речка, которая по правую руку от нас. Понятное дело, что это не река Припять, но вода здесь из реки Припять. Это канал охладитель, который был подсоединен к пруду охладителю. Сейчас эти выходы перекрыты, перекрыты двумя э, двумя воротами. Здесь уровень воды, как вы можете даже сейчас наблюдать, был намного выше, и вода в этом канале никогда не замерзала, даже в самые суровые зимы. Всегда температура была между 25 и 30 градусами Цельсия. Понятное дело, когда станция находилась в работе. So, friends, I will tell you the same information when we will leave our bus. Join outside. that this is the deconstruction of the other reactors is what you just said and this is the canal or reservoir for the cooling systems of the reactors when they were operational Mama made it. <laughs> Chernobyl. Bucket list. Done. <laughs> Chernobyl. Completed it, mate. Done with all your meal in general. Don't forget to um, put your trays on the automatic line. We shall be in uh, on the same second floor in the same room where you will have your meal. And on your way back, it's no need to pass through the frame second time. Uh, I guess I will show you all these procedures and then we'll wait for you near the bus. When you will be done, let's meet up near the bus. Так, сейчас у нас время кушать. Мы с вами приближаемся к столовой. Там проведем, думаю, 25-30 минут. Больше не требуется, мне кажется. Какая будет процедура? Первая рамка рад контроля. Будет слева и будет одна справа. Слева для дам, справа для джентльменов. Потому что уборная для парней, соответственно, после правой рамки и направо. После этого поднимаемся на второй этаж, берем еду. Вот и. Собственно, кушаем. Приступаем к приему пищи. 
25 минут, 30 минут будет достаточно. Как поели, не забудьте положить поднос на автоматическую линию. Она будет на том же втором этаже, в том же холле, где будем кушать. На обратном пути рамку ратка. Gloves on, gloves off. I don't know, I'm assuming. Seventy local. It's about two or three pound for lunch. Local, we got soup, soup bread, bread, a muffin, 
omelette and pasta, two glasses of juice, and uh, yeah. when they were here in the excursions that Soviet nuclear energy, this technology, power plants, they are the most peaceful, peaceful stay, stable and safe technology, power plants and energy in the world. Again, as you see nowadays, they were almost right. Bushes, grass and so on, especially their roads. And it's no need to worry about these particles in the mud. Uh, we are approaching the uh, reactor number four and just a moment. This is like the, uh, the pumping station that sends water up to the plant to cool down the nuclear reactor. Second squad was from Pripyat city. And now finally please pay attention to the left. You will see Chernobyl nuclear power plants. From left to the right, reactors number one. With the raster of number three, and If you will talk about the artifacts in the real life, not in the computer game, it can be a random object. It is extremely Стало припять, на самом деле это не обычный монумент, как, каким он вам покажется с первого взгляда. Это что-то наподобие очередной границы, но между территорией города и между территорией, где возник рыжий лес. Сегодня спрашивали, в принципе, отвечаем.
Say don't touch. Right, yeah. So friends, I'd like to welcome you in Pripyat city, city of broken windows and broken lines. According to the official service statistic, here used to live up to 49, 50,000 people. According to the same official service statistic from this place in 1986, were evacuated only a few thousand more people than the government expected, because it was almost summer season, season of the vacations, and so on. So here were more people than the government expected. About the evacuation process, citizens of Kiev, they remembered these days as a days almost without any single bus in Kiev city, because more than 1,100 civilian and military buses they were only waited just for the command to enter Pripyat city and start evacuation process in evening 26 of April. Unfortunately for the locals from this city, such command was given only early in the morning of 27. Then at 2 p.m. all these buses entered to Pripyat city and process was started. It was finished in 3 hours and 30 minutes. In 3 hours and 30 minutes, Pripyat city officially became a ghost town. Pripyat city wasn't completely abandoned ghost town. Some facilities, like some objects, uh, like a swimming pool, Lazurny, uh, Spetsatom facility, they were in use until 1998, 2009, for example, so Pripyat never was abandoned. Right now, our bus will leave us on the central square, it will drop us on the central square, uh, will be a second part of this journey. We will continue our journey on foot. It will take one hour, 30 minutes, two hours approximately. And then we will meet up with our bus on another point. Let's put on the GoPro because it's going to be an hour and a half of exploring Pipriot. And rather than edit it, I'll put like um, an intro minute or two of the, the footage cut down make something sort of interesting out of that for you guys to see before and then you can just flick through at your leisure of the um of actually exploring Pipriot but um yeah we just I just keep it rolling in one take after this
Yeah, it's pretty disgusting. Yeah. 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 It's not dangerous, it's one kill. <laughs> Supermarket. Yeah, this is so surreal. Palletizer. Thank you. 
This is all fucking stuff. Sorry, guys. I'm just Stalactite. Stalactite and stalactite. Well, it was apocalyptic, wasn't it? Well, I presume all the locals would have stolen and taken, stolen and taken as much as the produce as they can. But then maybe components that were tested. Well, there's 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 mattress. These are definitely beds. These are mattresses on the floor. The trolleys, or maybe it's a, a bit of a mix. Yeah. Because these are definitely headboards that were probably attached to a bed at some point. Uh, little seat, maybe a furniture shop and a bit of a. They look like ice symbols, so like yeah. it was like ice cream and uh, frozen fruit and stuff. Yeah. See those little mm. yeah, bits and then at the back. But a bit of a mix. Which of that? You got up there? Mm. Pretty. You can see as well, you only need a little bit of water and you can see the finish on these steps, couldn't you? Yeah. We're losing them, we're losing them, we've got to go. <laughs> 24, 24 hour challenge. <laughs> Overnight challenge. It's madness. 30 madness. <laughs> All of that is going to get cut from this video. <laughs> Floppy dick. Sure Sorry. You, you ever use a floppy disk, Daniel? Is that what time will shit hit the fan?
these pictures, they are not 100% true. Mm -hmm. So it's okay to see this picture in front of you right now. So they are just a like, mm -hmm. normal part, usual part of this ghost town. So, about this building in front of us. This building in the past was a simple, typical post office. Nothing special until catastrophe happened. Right after, on the second floor of this building, we supported the most famous message in the Soviet Union if we want to talk about the Second World War The message was the next. Steel. Hang on, by Fred. Very. Move, just move straight through. The look back after. What the fuck is that? Hairdresser? Yeah. Yeah. Silent Hill. Yeah. <laughs> Kinda. <laughs> Fucking here he is. Just saying, it looks like Silent Hill. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually. Yeah, raid siren. I would, oh yeah, that's a good point. Fuck yeah, good point, let's go. I didn't know about that. Didn't know about that. These bits of fluff floating around is probably a special. Careful, man. Very good. You're more likely going to get cancer from that first off, and you're not from radiation. Absolutely. If the uh, nuclear radiation is in case, you're a special off more. So, what have we got rain to walk around for then in before we. Uh, Should we go up there? Yeah. No, let's go up in the big one, to the top. I think they might warn us that we last left or something. <laughs> Yeah. What's in There's glass and stuff there. Put it on. Old soldiers just. Probably. Slav. Um, gangsters and stuff. That's why they think about why all the windows are broken. Yeah. Probably bored.
nice breast loss. Mm-hmm. Thanks for it. Thanks for it. And I bet you that's absorbed some radiation. As <laughs> it goes down. Put it to the asbestos and it goes down. But it is covered in red ticks, so I wouldn't go near it. Oh my mate, it's so bad in Germany. My cat, stroke yeah. of my cat is like reading Braille for fuck's sake. It just bumps everywhere. No, we was gonna move. I cacked it the other day because we were walking through like Hydro Park. Some of you guys may recognise that building from Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2. Or Call of Duty Modern Warfare, where you um, you come along this pathway and uh, there's a pool inside. I hear a drone. Yeah. Oh yeah. Try and get the uh, drone fish. Plug. Yeah. What? No, you just ruined a nice little moment. I was in the middle of a dialogue. Oh, okay. I thought you were trying to get my attention. Can I put attention to this picture?
Got a nice picture of you, boy. I see him before I came out. Is it appropriate to pose, like to just take a photo of yourself with it? I don't know. It looks big, but it's just. If I do it first, will that make you guys feel better? No, 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 no. I'm saying it's perfectly okay, it the but like well, when it first came every out... Every tourist comes and does it, doesn't every it? Every tourist does it, doesn't it, yeah. It's not really a place of suffering, though, is it? Yeah. Catch a <laughs> Gotta catch them all. Might want to touch the air. Oh, okay, yeah, no, fair enough, yeah, I probably shouldn't touch that. that to? You went up to 2.78 then. Wow. That's just... just this is so Despite what's happened, it's still incredible, isn't it? Yeah. You can imagine this is what it's going to be like.